by Brentech here, where tech is made simple. Just a quick update on Adobe Flash Player in Windows 10, and that is that the Windows 10 Patch Tuesday update for July of 2021 will remove all uh, traces and remnants of the Flash Player in, in Windows 10. Now, I honestly thought my days of talking about Adobe Flash Player were over, but nonetheless, Microsoft says that it is slowly removing the Flash Player from all versions and editions of Windows 10, and that's also all the older versions as well. And this is through an optional update that removes the Flash Player um, and is basically being available for download for you to install through Windows updates since February of this year, 2021. And it's been showing up for different users at different phases and is basically on a controlled staggered phased rollout. Now, Microsoft first started, um, you know, ended support for Adobe Flash Player in their web browsers. That was the Microsoft Edge web browser and also Internet Explorer 11. And in February, Microsoft published the uh, uh, optional update KB4577586 in Windows Update, and that was to remove the uh, Flash Player and all traces of Flash Player from Windows 10. Now, the update I'm talking about is if I go to the 18th of February, that was when it was installed in my part of the world, and it was update for removal of Adobe Flash Player for Windows 10 version. 20H2, that would also be 2004, KB4577586. Now, the problem with this update is that it removed Adobe Flash Player from your system, but you had to apply the update because it was an optional update, and not everybody has actually applied this update. I did apply it, and you know, Adobe Flash has been removed from my system, thankfully, because if you are still using Adobe Flash on your operating system and haven't applied that update, you really are putting yourself at an unnecessary security risk. Now, you also noticed if you applied KB4577586, if we just head over to the old control panel, the legacy control panel, it also removed the Flash Player um, entry in the con control panel that used to reside in the control panel um, you know, for years basically in Windows 10, and that was also removed with that optional update. Now, the new um, information is that if you haven't applied this update, what's going to happen in June of um, 2021? That will be the, the update that rolls out in the latter half of the month, known as a preview build. That's also going to be an optional update, and that will give you another chance to download and manually uninstall um, the Adobe Flash Player from Windows 10. Now, if for some reason you don't, you know, you haven't um, applied KB4577586 um, and you also then don't apply the next optional update, which is coming in the latter half of June, then basically in the July patch Tuesday of 2021, um, if you skip the optional update, the Flash Player will be automatically and re removed from your system in the compulsory uh, compulsory and mandatory automatic update that will roll out for Patch Tuesday in July. And that will basically be the nail in the coffin, ultimately, in Windows 10. So I just wanted to update you. So, you know, if you are still running Flash Player, there's no reason to run it. It's just a security risk. And apply the update if you haven't already. And if you don't, you're going to be have it forcefully removed from your system anyway in July. And just a little side note is that Windows 10 21H1, also known as the May 2021 update, and that is the first um, feature update of this year, will be the first version of Windows to not ship with the Adobe Flash Player. So that's good to know. I hope you found this video useful. Once again, thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.